Hey there, folks. My name is Shook, and welcome to my Let's Play of Octodad. Now, uh, about a couple weeks ago, I saw a tweet by Generic B, and uh, one of the YouTubers I like to watch, made a tweet about this game called o Octodad, The Dadliest Catch, which obviously is a very strange-sounding name, so I had to look it up. And it is truly a very strange... A title and concept for a game. Apparently, you're a an octopus who is also a father and a husband, but your family does not know that you're an octopus, despite having somehow conceived children. Um, which, unless they wouldn't be your children, I, well, I, I, let's not go too much into too much detail there with the uh, realism. But yes, I decided. Gotta check this game out. It's a quirky game. Uh, it looks like it's gonna be a pretty short game so I can wrap it up pretty quickly so, so I don't have another uh, unfinished game on my channel. Um, and uh, this game was developed by as a uh, college project by the uh, group called Young Horses, I guess is the name of their name of their uh, company. That you would think they they guess what you say they name their company, and uh, this is Octodad, the, the original game, and they're making a uh, yeah. sequel to it that's coming out on the thirtieth, I think. Uh, Octodad, that deadliest catch. So, yeah. yeah, I was like, I need to check this out, and it, I've got to find out what this is about. So, without any more speaking, let's let's find out together. Pretty fancy home there. Wake up, dear. Today is a huge day. Up, up. Oh, oh my, a huge God. day. <gasps> it's past noon. You need to. <laughs> <laughs> it's way past noon. Hands mode. Move the mouse to move the arm. Holding the right mouse button on control plus left and moving the mouse forward and back will raise and lower the arm. Okay, so right mouse button. Okay. So that will move over the arm. Okay, when an object is highlighted green, pressing and holding the left mouse button will move your arm to grab it. Press spacebar or the middle mouse to switch modes. Feet mode. Hold the left mouse button to raise and the left foot. The mouse. Okay. While the foot is raised, moving the mouse will move the foot. Okay. Releasing the mouse button will set the foot down. Combine moving the left and right feet to move around the house. Welcome to Octodad. Follow these instructions to complete the tutorial. The skill. Pick up the journal. And exit the door. Look around your room. Hold A or D to look side to side. Okay. Doing that. If you want to know about the particulars of a room, check the story tab in the menu of each room. Okay. Cool. Gotcha. You got to escape your room. Oh, crap. Are you holding your prisoner or something? Click the left mouse button to raise your left foot. Woo! -hee -wee -dee 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 -dee. Push the mouse forward to move your left foot forward. Whoa! Hello. Whoa! Crap. Release the left click to lower your left foot. Okay. Repeat for the right foot. Walk to the alarm clock. So what would be the alarm clock? Perhaps it's the thing with the arrows. Okay. Whoa. Maybe I need to... Ha! <laughs> 
Wait, I'm trying to eat, do. Don't do W A. Don't do was the. Okay. Okay. Uh, and woohoo! Turn it off. Oh, okay. Move them forward and back. Click the left mouse button. Oh, okay. Get away from me, man. Alarm clock. I don't need you. I am awake. You can switch back in the feet mode by pressing the middle mouse button. Okay, you can still hold your object. Cool. Press the middle mouse button or spacebar to switch to hands mode. Okay. You're holding an object. Press the left mouse button to drop the object. Okay. Maybe I'm not supposed to. Raise the arm, hold the right mouse button, and slide the mouse. Grab the red makeup kit on the drawers. Okay, uh... Okay, here's what, how you can look around. Cool, cool. Okay, yeah, that's why I thought that. Oh, I'm gonna have to get used to this. This is gonna take some time. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Go, go, gadget legs. Okay, now. No, don't grab there. That's inappropriate. Go up. Okay, maybe I need to. Okay, um. Uh, you need to turn around? Oh, I don't need a book. Okay. Oh, hello, I got it. Interacting with some objects will give you suspicion. For instance, your dad and you don't want Well you told me to pick it up. Maybe we need to Okay. Yeah, I was in hands mode. Go grab your journal to end the tutorial or explore a bit. Okay, well. This is going to be a, uh, oh, oh, okay. Ah, oh, I dropped it. Yeah, he's, he's just uh, propping himself up on the table. Alright. Grab the book. Okay. We are moving on. Oh, he's writing in his diary. Alas, another day begins and I have yet to be discovered. My cephalopod nature remains secret as long as I... In a properly human fashion, my darling Scarlet and my children. This this charade is soon to end. I will prepare a decoy and okay, distract the wife. Escape the basement. Need to finish getting the gift. Is that what he's saying? Happy anniversary! <laughs> oh, honey, I know you've been working late in the basement, but take tonight off, okay? I have the most romantic dinner planned. I'm going to the store. Take care of the kids and do your chores. 
Hmm. Okay, well. Press escape. Okay, we gotta build a mannequin. We need a banana from the kitchen, suit from the living room, octopus doll from kids' bedroom, and build the mannequin. Okay. Last, my darling wife desires a rendezvous for our anniversary, but my device is far from ready. A decoy dummy is in order. I must find my fancy dinner suit, a stuffed toy in my likeness, and a banana, for obvious reasons. Uh, what obvious reasons are those? Once I've found them, I shall assemble them on the log at the dining room table. When that is finished, I can begin work on my machine, provided there are no other distractions. You know, I'm, you know, I'm, uh, oh. Is it for his face, the banana? It's kind of like his mustache. Would you call that mustache? I don't know. All right. Now... Can I push the door open? Woo! Woo! Doing a weekly dance. My arms, I can't control. Okay. I'm assuming I can't go there. Man. I don't think he has to worry about fooling his family, you know, if they haven't figured this out, they've got issues. Just kick the trains. Tell me what I tell you about leaving your, leaving your toys out. I mean, you can get spanked by eight hands. Okay. Can I save this? Yeah. Oh, I can save and quit. Oh, I gotta find... I gotta find different things. Where am I at? I'm guessing I'm in the kids' room? So I was in the dining room? I guess I wasn't paying much uh, attention there. My dear daughter Stacy is too fearful to sleep while monsters still plague the room. I shall put her mind at ease. And luckily she is clutching her beloved octopus toy. If I were to take it while she remained awake, then the monster in the room would be me. Admittedly, the, admittedly, the goings on in this place are unusual. Where do these spiders come from? What is that noise in the closet? Let's see if I'm exterminator. Okay. Check the closet for monsters. Mon monsters? Yes, the monsters. The monsters are causing havoc. I do have to pull it. Okay, is it? Pushing, pulling. Okay, neither. Knocking. Hello, monsters. Are there any monsters? Okay. Apparently, that's not it. Oh, wait a second. Can I? No. <laughs> I'm stuck. I'm stuck again. <laughs> Oh, oops, no, no, let go, let go. All right. Just ignore me, kid.
Just resting my leg here. It's, it's, it's a little tired. Uh, wait, now my other leg's getting really tired. What is that in the... What the crap is that behind me? We will meet again, Octopus. What? Why was there a French shelf in your... Why is there a French shelf in your daughter's closet? I'm confused. Oh, whoa. Sorry, sorry folks. Uh, I ate something really rough. Do I look like a unicorn given type of dad? Can I? Oh, I, ah, I can do it now. I had to look in the closet first and. Okay. Makes sense. Man, these are. These are the. Sports Johnson. Okay. There's no comment to be made on that. Oh, I, the, the spiders, where are they at? Oh, there's a spider. Oh, that, those are some, that's a big spider. Stomp. No, go. I got that one. Oh, man, this is... I'm doing the I'm doing the killing spider stance. Oh, whoa, crap! That's a lot. Okay, we've got a serious issue here. All right, keep moving both. Gotta move both legs. Oh, crap! Oh, crap! I'm I'm losing. Oh. You get him, Dad. Yeah, most of them. <laughs> I'm glad they weren't poisonous. He'd be dead, kid. What all do I have to do? Hmm. Hopefully that's the worst of it. Okay. Oh, there's nobody in the neighborhood. That's freakish. Animal charm. Yeah, that's not a kid's book. I think it's making fun of Animal Farm. Oh, don't hit that. Just there. Oh, God. Get it. Get it. I got it. I got it. What is that? What, what book is this? Chad Bolton. Doesn't look like a kid's book. Throw it out the window. I need children's books. You know, I read some Stephen King books when I was young. Maybe Animal Charm is what I'm supposed to do. Is the book in the thing up there? Oh, good grief. Oh, I'm gonna have... Uh, I still ain't got used to this. Okay, loop around, then re-loop the other way, then loop, loop, 
Oh, hit the wall. And, uh, okay, it's kind of stuck there. Yeah, there's a book there. There's two books. Oh, whatever. Just get out of the way. Don't mind me, Stacy. Your dad's throwing lamps around. It's normal. I don't see any books. Besides the two blank ones there. Hmm. Are they going to be in the room? I figured they would be here in the room. Alright, now. And then... That one. Remember to gotta alternate. Man, I'm not coordinated enough for this game. <laughs> You're the greatest dad in the world. What? Okay. Thumbs up. Get a replacement doll from the toy chest. I replace the octo doll with the blue dolphin doll. Okay, blue dolphin. Ah. I mean, you don't want to eat. You mean you don't want a giraffe? Why don't Why don't you want a giraffe, kid? Whoa! This is a very unstable chest. Toy chest. We need to. Uh... Oh, here's a story. And it's stuck. There's a blue dolphin doll here. Well, <laughs> I'm just gonna put it right there. Ah. Yes, we will. Uh... You know what? We will. We will block the view from the windows. Nobody peer, peer in here, okay? Yeah. It is in the middle of night. What, what they got? I guess they ha live in a very secure neighborhood. They either don't care, you know. You know we don't have your window wide open. I octopus. I need a ball. Woo, you make an A. Robot. Wee. Ah. Oh. oh, get over there. Get up. 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 Ah. Oh. Oh, yes, exactly. Oh. I am clever. Clever commentary skills by working the uh, letters in. You know, it fits like a T. And the obvious answer to this is do and a dolphin all right remember to alternate gotta alternate whoa and do a spin do 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 okay all right do a spin Oh, take a dolphin to the face. Oh, yeah. We did it. Oh, I got a quiet escape. Uh, 
Oh, don't hit the lamp. Oops. Ooh. Oh. Don't slam the door. Don't slam the door. Get up the stale. Uh, I keep wanting to do the uh, camera. Okay, got it. Turn me alternate. Alternate. Just move back. It's very simple. Oh, we did this. We just did it. Oh, yeah. Woo, yeah. So... I hope you folks enjoy this. I will uh, I will finish this game. Like I said, it should be a pretty short series. Hopefully only about four or five episodes at the most. Um, and I'm going to uh, give me ideas for short games like this. Uh, I'm, I wasn't quite feeling like playing Carbal Space Program and there's going to be days where I just don't feel like playing specific games. So give me Give me ideas for short games, with, you know, sort of like this. Strange, quirky, preferably free or cheap. Uh, I don't have much of a gaming budget. I, I've used up it more, way more than I would like to. Well, not way more, but, you know. Uh, so, yeah, I'll probably do that or maybe uh, short little, uh, our, our videos one-off videos of games that are now for beta that sort of thing so give me ideas you know but anyway i shall see you in the next one and i do hope you enjoyed this this was a very strange game <laughs> it's uh it's definitely a good game from what i can tell a little frustrating but then again i'm not the most coordinated person in the world this guy moves kind of like i do in real life not as bad maybe 40% is bad, possibly. But anyway, I will see you guys in the next one. Farewell there, folks.